Yo, what's up guys, the Goblinator, and today what I have for you guys is a Bell 27 Obsidian Steed DNA Bomb on the map Terrace. I actually go off. I get 29 of the kills in the first round, which is kind of unfortunate. I really wanted to finish it off, but then I had to wait till the second round and be nervous, but I found an AFK kid and just killed him and got the DNA Bomb. So anyway, this is the Bell 27 Obsidian Steed, which this and the Speakeasy are pretty much like... Those two are considered the best elite guns in the game. First off, I just want to say thank you guys for 2,000 likes on my video yesterday. It was an ASM1 Speakeasy DNA Bomb. If you guys haven't seen that, I suggest going to check it out. And I want to say if we could hit 2,000 likes or even more than we hit on yesterday's video, that would mean a lot to me. So make sure you guys leave a like on this video and uh, let me know in the comment section below what do you guys prefer, the Obsidian Steed or the ASM1 Speakeasy. So let me talk a bit about the Obsidian Steed. Basically, the stats on this gun are all over the place, and I'm going to throw up the stats on the on the video screen right now I guess you could call it on the video right now on the gameplay and basically the stats are all over the place some of the stuff minus one of the fire rate plus one on this blah 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 the main thing that matters about the battle obsidian steed is of course the plus two damage you know the minus one accuracy minus one fire rate those things uh, they're minuscule to the damage the damage is the biggest thing on a gun probably I'd say damage is number one and then accuracy and then a few other things really matter you know mobility kind of matters handling matters a little bit but mainly the the damage and the accuracy are, and the fire rate of course as well, I don't know I was missing on, out on that. Those are the three things you really want to focus on when you're looking at a supply drop gun or uh, an enlisted, a professional or an elite gun and you're trying to figure out is this gun good, is it worth using, is it better than the OG uh, Battle 27 or is it better than the original, is it better than this version I have, you know what I'm trying to say here. So the Battle 27 Obsidian Steed is better than any other gun assault rifle variant in the game to be honest some people say oh I like the inferno better Man, I, if you like the inferno better that's on you but statistically I guess we could all agree or pretty much most people agree that the BAL 27 is statistically the best assault rifle in the game other than like the steel bite uh, gives you plus three damage I think the steel bite actually absolutely melts I'm gonna go on and get a DNA with that gun tonight and then I'll upload that one for you guys too but yeah let's talk a bit about uh, this gun and what maps you want to use this gun on so basically any map that is an assault rifle map is good for this gun. This is a fully automatic assault rifle. The maps it specializes on, I would say, are probably like Terrace, Retreat, uh, Recovery, Comeback even you could use it. Comeback is sort of an SMG or an assault rifle map, but this gun is something that can be done at any range. As you can see there, I just drop shot at three kids with a hip firing or something like that, and it goes in. The thing about the Battle 27 Obsidian Steed is you have such a big clip with extended mags, and the class setup you guys want to run with it is probably going to be the one I run in this gameplay, and I'll give it to you right now. So get out your notepads, guys, because this is the class setup. You want to run the extended mags, the stock, and then the grip. Now, some people really don't like the stock, and if you don't like the stock, that's fine. As I stab that guy in the back, get knife, mother trucker. And anyway, if you guys don't like the um, the stock, that's fine. You don't have to use the stock. I would probably recommend the quick draw sight. As I if, do, I really get that kill right there. Oh, I, I think I, that was going to be it for the Dina, but I get it in the second round here. If you guys don't like stock, throw on the quick draw. If you guys don't think you need the grip, you can throw on the quick draw as well. This battle kicks a little bit more than the OG, so I like the grip. If you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to drop a like on it. Make sure to subscribe. If you guys are new to my channel, subscribe for a cookie. Let's try and beat 2,000 likes. That would mean a lot to me. And as always, have a great day. Sub for a cookie. I'm out. Peace. Love you guys. Woo woo.